Waiting for weed has become the norm in Canada. Ever since legalization last October, Canadians have been lined up, often to find out stores are sold out. And now some experts are warning those lineups could last quite a while. Some experts have recently said it may take up to five years to address cannabis shortages across the country, but some are more optimistic. I really think this is a temporary growing pain. Lineups at this Montreal shop have been around since opening day. The shop is now only open four days a week to deal with the demand. Lester says there are things governments can do to alleviate the strain. If they would allow product to move across provinces, that would certainly help overnight. If they allowed uh, non-licensed growers to at least supply the shortage until you know they, the licenses catch up, that would solve the problem overnight. Licensed growers have been expanding exponentially since the government announced it would legalize weed. But Lester says the black market is still booming. You know, I have some friends who buy from some, uh, um, you know, some of their dealers, uh, you know, that they've, they're, they're still using the same dealers they used over the years. And those dealers are saying that business, if anything, is better. But taking business away from the black market was one of the government's top priorities. Lester predicts a significant shift over the next few years. I think very soon we're going to have uh, on every corner, just like there are depeners or, or SAQs to buy alcohol and beer and stuff, there's going to be a dispensary or a, some kind of a way to buy uh, cannabis. In Ottawa, Nigel Newlove, City News.